Hey, it's Everyday Ultraman, it's you, and we got a big package today for you guys. A really big package. What could it be? What could it be? Of course, it's Ultraman because in this channel, we only. Sorry. As always, Choi has to disturb me. Uh, I can never shoot in peace because you always disturb me. Okay, can you go away please? Excuse me, sir. Okay, don't. Don't catch on, eh? Okay, leave me alone, alright? Okay. Of course, this channel is an Ultraman channel, so of course, I will only be uploading Ultraman toys for you guys. So, of course, this is gonna be one hell of an Ultraman. Let's see, I'm excited. Ooh, it's a big box, guys. As you can see, it's a really big box. I'm excited. You guys better be excited with me. Don't let me be excited all alone. Ooh, very sexy indeed. As you can see, um, we got the cat, and then we got toys. Hot Wheels made in Thailand. I it better not be Hot Wheels inside, cause. I don't like Hot Wheels, I don't even know Hot Wheels. And look at this sexy leg, ooh, very nice. Okay, Choi, sit there. I'm hoping it better be Ultraman on the inside. It better not be... Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I need a bigger space to shoot, guys. Help me reach 1,000 so I can have money to buy a bigger space. Okay. Ah. Space. Ah, Ooh. Ooh la la. Oh, sorry. Ooh la la. What we have here? We got a lot of trash. You don't want this. Open a promo panetton. Is that food? Ah, don't want this. Ooh, very sexy looking Ultraman. Aren't you just a toy? Okay, excuse me. Fish get. How? Dang it. Jangan gigit. Okay. Okay. So, you, okay, we gotta set it up. How many Ultraman we have here? I don't know. But let's see what kind of Ultraman we got. Okay, it's all in one bundle. I think you have to open it up to see. Come on, guys. you with me. Let's pray we get good Ultraman. Either we get like Dinah or Gaia or Tiga. One of those good ones. It'll be amazing to get. The, the trio has... Okay, okay, let's open it partially. So let's put it in the back. Okay, let's put it back in the box. And let's just take one out. The first Ultraman that we have is... Boom! Spatium Zeperion! Okay, cool. You know me, I like Spatium Zeperion. Ooh, this is actually nice. Compared to the Spatium Zeperion that I already had, it wasn't as nice as this one. But yeah, the, the back is still ugly. Uh, yeah, I, have to, I have to say, look at this. The back is still ugly. There's nothing that you can change. Ultra Orb Spatium Superior. Nice. Very nice indeed, guys. First Ultraman that we have in this box. Really good box. Really good. You know, like I said, I love Orb. But, you know, when you mix it with Tiga, I even like it more. Because the color is just really nice. Purple, black, red. All the good colors. And then you got a bit of gold here. So that's a beautiful, except the eyes. The eyes is, if you look at my Spatium Superior unboxing video, you know that I never liked the eyes because the eyes just look very plain, looks very white. It should not be that color, but yeah, you can never have a perfect. So yeah, guys, the first ultimate that we have is our Spatium Superior. Very cool. So let's put one here. No. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's hope, let's hope Choi doesn't. This right. Ish. Let's hope it doesn't. Okay, what to do? What to do? Okay, tolong lah, tolong, please, please. Huh? Kesian, kesian si kamu. Okay, don't leave me here. Okay, our second Ultraman we have is AT. Woo! I kind of like AT, man. AT is AT is really cool. I bet you don't know Ultraman AT is called Ultraman AT simply because it was released in. The year 1980. 
very i guess they run out of creative names but yeah but i have to say the back looks terrible oh looks like really cheap you know if you look from the back it looks like some cheap toy but if you look at from the front you see the beautiful ed right here i mean you know that ed has a a bit of a Kamen Rider inspiration. I, I read it somewhere that AT was inspired a bit with a Kamen Rider, a Kamen Rider design. That's why his, uh, his mouth has a bit like a bug mouse, uh, mouse because it was supposed to be like Kamen Rider. What are you looking at? No, he's staring at me. I don't know why is he angry or something. Oi! Remember? Okay, alright. So yeah, anyway, sorry about that. So yeah, that's why or uh, AT has a very unique mouth and head because you know it was inspired by Kamen Rider. Yeah, can Kamen Rider are like bugs? And then he has all Ultraman has this downward, but this one has upward, so that's why it's unique. But I still have to say AT is one of my favorites, especially his uh, transformation device. You know how he make that sound, ching! It's really cool, really cool, guys. And this toy is really nice. I think I've never had an AT before. This is my first AT, I think. Yeah, but too bad I won't, you know, keep it. I'll probably sell it. Yeah. But, you know, if I reach 1,000 subscribers, I'll give it away. Definitely confirm. So, yeah, guys. The second Ultraman we got is a beautiful Ultraman 80. Too beautiful. Mm, yum, yum, yum. Very sexy. Okay. Dananto. He's sleepy already. He's gonna go to sleep. So, he won't disturb us shooting anymore. Nice. Okay, let's just... The second Ultraman that we have is, oh no, do it, sorry, is boom, we got Cosmos, hey, that's cool, I don't think I have this Cosmos, do I have this Cosmos? I think I might have this one, but uh, not this size, I think I might have the 6.5 one, but nevertheless, Cosmos, the Peace Ultraman, very cool. As you can see, Cosmos is number 16. This image is wrong because this Cosmos doesn't fight, does he? He's a, he's a really peaceful, loving guy. He doesn't fight with anyone. Cosmos had to transform to other forms to fight. So that's weird. So yeah, no, I guess it's unique. One of the nicest, uh, peace-loving, non-fighting, non-aggression Ultraman. There is Cosmos. And he's all blue. He joins the rank of Ag uh, Agus Purple. Or is he? I think the same, oh no, yeah, I goes purple. I would say Hikari. Hikari is blue. So yeah, one of the few Ultraman that's actually blue. Yeah, including the new one, Ultraman Blue, you know, Russell and Blue, R&B. So yeah, but still Cosmo looks beautiful. Although he has the most simplest design. Uh, it does have a simple design simply because uh, he has other forms. His other forms are much, much uh, more unique. And like this one, which is just pure, simple, this one is like taro and then this one is i don't know unique so, but still overall I, I would say cosmos looks nice very cool very cool indeed guys nice loving it okay so we put it here on top of choice like so yeah we got three beautiful ultraman so far guys i'm loving this you know so far we're going we're getting good ultraman here guys you know it can't just be me right we're getting good ultraman so yeah what could it be what could it be Huh? Ta-da! We got another blue Ultraman. We got just speak of the devil. We got Ultraman Hikari, the friend of Mebius. Ta-da! I got Mebius, but I got a big one. This is the six point five, and this is the five point five. Nice. So yeah, this is the big. So this is the Mebius, and this is partner Hikari. Wow, very cool. I think I also have a Hikari, a big one, but I don't know where it is, I can't find it. Never mind, I think I, I have it somewhere, but I just can't be bothered to find it. So yeah guys, but this is Hikari, very beautiful. I have to say Hikari is definitely one of the most unique Ultramans, especially the design. Uh, it's guaranteed uh, inspired by Zofi, because if you know Zofi, he has like these metal dots on his body. So it's the same as Hikari, if you look at Hikari, he has like metal dots, see? So this one is inspired by Zofi. Maybe it's the little brother of Zofi? Who knows? You know, no one knows. But yeah, cool design. And then the DX of Zofi is really cool. This one. Yeah. It's like you combine these two ching and then it transform. And then the head has like one, two, three spot. Three. Oh, this is the ear. You have a spiky ear. It's like an elf. But nonetheless, it's cool. 
And I think Hikari has another form as well, but I'm not sure. Here, Hikari is using a blade. I don't remember him using a blade. Does he use a blade? Let me know in the comment if Hikari does actually use a blade. If he does, where's his blade though? But he can't beat like Agu. Agu has a really cool blade. You know, like the laser blade. But yeah, that's why I like Agu. Agu is just so cool. Hikari, Hikari still is not bad. Oh yeah, and then he's got his sharp shoulder pads right here. So that's still cool. Nice. As always, the back is plain, but you can't complain. Okay, so far we got two blue Ultramans. That's cool. Very cool, guys. Four good Ultramans. Man, this is going good. This is going good. Oh, oh, oh. What Ultraman is this? What Ultraman is this? What Ultraman is this? This is Taro. I've had Taro before. I think in my massive unboxing where I unboxed like 30 of these, I had Taro before. Hmm, very cool. Taro is of course the original number six. Yeah, how many? How much is this? 80, 15. So there's 14 Ultraman before 80. Wow, that's a lot. I never knew that. That's a case. So, so yeah, Taro is the sixth Ultraman brother, son of Ultra Father and son of Ultra Mother, mother of Ultra and father of Ultra. Very cool, guys. Um, stuff. That's my little brother playing his game. So just ignore the background noise. So yeah, guys. I still him and Leo still my favorites. Uh, Leo, uh, Leo, Leo is kicks right. This one's a bit like martial arts, I think. And then he's knowing the story makes podium something. Beep. Uh, that's like one of my favorites. And then you know the part where Taro becomes all fire and then he just hugs when it explodes. I think still that's kind of cool. Taro has a son now, Taiga, right? I don't know, man. I don't have Taiga. Nice. So yeah, uh, Ultra Father and Ultra Mother are grandparents now. Since since Taro has a son, Taiga. <laughs> Just weird. Now it's a trend for have Ultraman as parents. For example, you have Seven with Zero, and then you have Taro with Taiga. Uh, Taiga has a unique, followed his dad unique body pad here, so that's cool, like father, like son. But unlike his father, Taro has just a plain red and silver, like Taiga had a lot of colors on his body. So I'll put you next to E. I'm loving this guys. We got nice cool Ultraman so far. Very beautiful, all oh, quite beautiful. Chon is asleep now. Okay, this one's finished. So, oh, got another batch here. Oh, we need to use scissors. This is open up. Oh, I see one. I see one. And it's one of my favorites. Look at my older videos. Look at my second video. You would know it's none other than Evil Tiga or Chaos Tiga. I don't know which one is it, but yeah. Oh my god, this brings back so much memory. I haven't played with this one since I unboxed it. I kept it in my display for for a long time. But yeah, guys, check out my older videos uh, if you want to see. Like a year ago, I uploaded me buying this and then making the stand. This is one of the OGs of my collection because, of course, the first two collection of mine is of course Ultraman Tiga and of course I had to get Evil Tiga because this is they're just too good these two man. Really nice. <laughs> so yeah and still I have to say Tiga Chaos or Evil Tiga will always be one of the best. I mean it just looks really beautiful, really nice. The exact evil version of Tiga. But as always I like I said before he's a bit chubbier compared to the real Tiga. So I don't know why they did that. So that's a bit of a mystery, but still, never mind. You still like it, and I like how his final, uh, like finisher move is the opposite of Tiga. You know how Tiga uses his arm like this. He just like that. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying, but you know, just look at my fighting evolution S rank mission. You know how uh they fight against each other. So yeah, just look at that video, and you'll know what I mean. But yeah, Ultraman 52. So that means there's 52 Ultraman that I have to collect. And there's probably more. There's probably like 70 
ish Ultraman 80 ish. So yeah, I might have to buy more soft bees, man. Damn. I have I only have like what 10, 20. So I need to buy more Ultraman, yeah. Beautiful, 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 beautiful Ultraman. Okay. So our sixth Ultraman. I'll put it next to Specium Zepurion. Very nice. Six top notch Ultraman guys. You'll be loving this. Come on, I know you love this. Okay, what Ultraman guys? What is it? What's the next one? What's the next one? Give me a name. Give me a name. That's stuck. Ta da! We got the classic original Ultraman. The first, the one, the only original Ultraman. Oh my god, guys. If you don't like him, you. Are not a fan of Ultraman. Every Ultraman fan must like him simply because he is the first, guys. The first Ultraman. Have some respect. He is the first Ultraman. Very cool. And he is, oh, surprise, number one. Nice. <laughs> Seriously, sometimes the simplest designs are always the best. Very cool. <laughs> As you can see, they managed to paint the entire body because, you know, you gotta respect the original and the simple, the design is too simple, but still beautiful. Oh my God. Nothing can be the classic. Tito la? Hey, Tito. My brother, man. I did cool. Okay. Never mind. So yeah, guys, you gotta love the original. Very classic. Very... Uh, What's the word? Very amazing. Mm. You know, have some respect. Have some respect, Joy. Don't be kicking the Ultraman. Uh, blow. Okay, so you belong in the center. I'll put you here. Uh, okay. Nice. Choi, don't get Of course, the Ultraman has to be at the center. Beautiful. Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna. Okay, since Choi is out of the way, we'll put it here. Box in the middle. And then the next Ultraman that we have is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So the 8th Ultraman is. Uh, Boom! We got another of the Ultra Brothers Ace! Come on, man. I'm loving this lot. We got the beautiful Ultraman Ace right here. Come on. You know. You know what it is. Number 5. Damn. Beautiful. You're looking beautiful, Ace. I have to say. Very unique head. But still, overall, still beautiful. Number 5. So we got a lot of the original brothers. We got 3 of the original brothers right here. Man. And then the last unboxing we had seven, remember that? Beautiful. Tiga, empat, lima, enam, tujuh, lapan, yeah. Us, what you mean, ace, sorry. I was about to say ace. I think I had, oh no, I don't, I, I have ace killer as well. So you guys check out my shop if you want that. So yeah, ace, I'll put you right next to Ultraman. Oh no. I think it's getting running out of space. So I might put like this, so. And then, Ultimate number 9 is uh, the father of Taro. Can you guess who it is? Without me saying, come on, it's an easy question guys. You should know. It's none other than father of Ultra. Look at him with his beard. Look at him. Oh my god. I got mother of Ultra. Uh, so I, now I got father of Ultra. So it's complete, yeah. It's a bit big, tough. Look at it. Oh my god, look at the body. Look at the pecs. Oh. Very tough indeed. So yeah, the father. And then the final Ultraman that we have is none other than woo, a lot of the originals. We got seven again. <laughs> How many sevens do you want? I'll give you all the sevens I can give you. I got another seven right here, man. Seven. 
So yeah, we got one, two, three, four of the seven Ultraman brothers. If you had the other three, it would be complete. My God. But still, this is one hell of a lot. Really cool, guys. Oh, oh. Nice. Wait, let me just get a nice shot of this, you know. Look at this. Beautiful. Ten. Oh, let get the cam. Let get the lights out. Beautiful. Ultraman lot. We got ten beautiful Ultraman, right? Yeah, that ten. Woo! I'm happy. This is probably my favorite Ultraman lot so far. Why? Because he has a lot of the originals, and he got Evil Tiga, so it's beautiful. So yeah, guys. Uh, I just wanted to show you the ten Ultraman that I bought. Now, if you want to check them out, just I put the link in the description. So yeah guys, um, like I said before on all the videos, if I reach 1,000 subscribers, I will do a giveaway. I will pick five people. Now I'll do like a competition. So the winners of the five people will get to pick any Ultraman and I'll buy that Ultraman for them. So they'll pick any Ultraman they want and I'll buy it for them. Uh, Daniel and Nokman, if you're still following me by then, I'll buy you guys too. Don't worry, you, you guys will get it because you guys have been a loyal supporter since day one. <laughs> so yeah, guys, um, help me get to 1,000 subscribers if you want some giveaways. Yeah. Okay, guys, that, that's, that's it for this video. Uh, it's been Everyday Ultraman, and thank you for watching. Bye.